What's up guys, it is JBeebs here, and welcome to another episode of the Circle of Bruges career mode series. Before we get into what games we're going to be playing for today, we're going to get in here and look at our Youth Academy. If you remember, I'd say it's doing pretty well. These three players that are good, real, I mean realistically, are going to be starting for us probably, maybe even later this season, definitely next season. So, I think we need to clear some way for them so I think wait buy cones in on loan so we can s we'll loan out the coastry so I think yeah I think we can promote Diego Van Dyke right now yeah I mean he's he's starting now I mean, he's Guaranteed starter. Fine cones bench. Van Dyke is in. 70 pace. 3 star, 3 star. Good, decent defending. Alright, not too shabby. Then there's the left back. Corin. And Vitinho. I think we can look to. I think we can sell Vitinho. And let's actually put a development plan on corn if, see if we, if we can shift him somewhere else you know shift him to defensive mid so then hopefully by then our young left back jerks will be in, I don't think he's gonna improve that much though well we'll worry about that later Looking at the month of December, we're, we're playing Club Bruges. We're having the Battle of the Bruges this month. It actually really matters because we're four points off of them in the league. I yeah, got some Youth Academy. Ooh, yes, sir. Oh, okay. Nope. Yes. Yes. And yes. Oh. Beautiful job from our French scout. Okay, we got some very good players coming in. But we're going to have to release a couple of players. Just because, sorry, but you don't really have a future at the club. But now we got go, we got a couple of really good players there. Yeah, I mean Tardy's still there. But this man, Lamb, Brech. Um, I think we keep him at one of those outside back positions. De Schmidt is five foot nine. Hmm, could we? Could he be trained to a center mid? Ah, it'd take a really long time. What about a right back? Yep, he can go at a right back. Moulin a nice winger. Yep, keep him a left mid. Gulbert, keep him an attacking mid. Chop is a striker. Alright, we're making big moves now. Alright. Sim game against... Ooh. Actually, I think I might prefer a loan to buy. I know probably this would be a good game to play, but the rivalry of Bruges and Bruges. Ah. Alright, so we are we're falling off the top four. Which is an issue because I would like I would like to be playing in Europe next season. A 
Oh, big game. Yeah, wanna, yeah. Nice thing is we sh we're bringing in a whole lot of money. Bringing in a bunch of money, so we sh I mean, we could make a big, big, big money signing. You know, a nice 10 million euro player. Oh, yep. Not a great player. Let's attend this press conference. Just, oh, boy, do we have a... Merci d'être avec nous. Nous allons pouvoir écouter vos questions. C'est parti. Big game. Voilà. Battle of Bruges. I mean, I think the team looks. I don't think we need to make any changes. We just got to go in there and execute our game plan. Oh. Let's get into the game. Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood Oh boy, the ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action we're hosting our city rivals. I mean, it's the same stadium, but we're the designated home team. Boys, this is what we trained for. We've been trying to become the big brother bully. Oh, they're on the best team. Best. But so are we. Yeah. Well, we're going to change that. Because we're going to beat you guys 5 nothing just so we can have a better defensive record than you. Because that's just how we operate. And we'll see. I love the Bruges kits. I like. I think the green and black just work really good together. But the the Bruges kits are pretty ugly. I mean, what is that? White. It was like light gray and dark gray with blue and black. Ugh, disgusting. Get those scars up, ladies and gentlemen. We're playing that four-four-one-one midfield. Van Dyke, Marcel and Bates, Corn in the back to Dylan and goal. Van der Bruges, Hogas center mids, Summers, Hazard on the wing, Hotish attacking mid, and the man himself, Ugbo, up top in that striker position. Circle Bruges, they, I mean, they, got, they have Mignolet in goal. Like, guys, realistically, we should score. They actually have Mignolet. For Liverpool chose Karius over him. That should say something about him. Let's not rush anything. It's too early in the game to get into that mental state and mindset of gosh, gotta do something, gotta do something, gotta do something. It's not to really get a hotage goal, baby. Fifth minute. We're up one nothing against the other Bruges. Oh boy! Beautiful dribble there from Hotage. Cuts it back. I mean, it wasn't actually, it wasn't even that great of a shot either. Like, it easily could have been more towards the, that far post, but. I guess Manurse is as good as Hotich is. Doesn't matter. 
And if I remember correctly from last game against this team, we struggled to stop Yost or Dost or Striker. Because he. Ah! Oh, it was a goal offside. Yep. Because he is a huge physical striker. And they just kept feeding him and feeding him. And it was a very high scoring affair last game as well. Which I mean, I would like for it not to be. Like, I'm, I'm okay when it went nothing. Oh, that's a foul. A yellow? And it's a yellow. You can't do that, sir. Ooh. Actually, that wasn't, that wasn't that bad of a cross. It's just actually pretty decent goalkeeping from Minule. Alright guys, let's just drop off now. Initial press didn't work. Okay, we're so calm we're passing the ball in our own box. Oh yeah, we can play Summers in behind. We can play Summers in behind. Uh, guys. Uh, I didn't think that... I thought that they're, the player that was in the box there marking that coach, I thought he was going to... Handball. I thought he was going to drift centrally, so that back post option would be there. Come on, Corn. Just stand him up. Oh, <gasps> uh, guys. The one man we have to worry about. Why did our keeper come out? You know he's heading the ball into the box. You know he's heading the ball right there. There's no need for you to come out just to get scored on. Dumb luck. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. This might have potential. This is just going to turn into a sprinting match on this left side of the field the entire game. Here we go. The conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Ooh. And the counter attack came to nothing. Uh guys, press, thank you. Over the touch line for a throw in. No, who's that? August? Yep. There you, you deserve that, honestly. Hazard. And in the end, no damage done. Rude former. The visitors' possession stats are brilliant, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front midfield. Very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. I'm telling you, Marcelin is our it's best defender. Course. I just don't know why. Because, I mean, there's nothing special about him, it's just... I guess he's just really good in-game. Run, Ugbo. You have the pace, you have the pace. 
Ah, I try to get this pass off. Hoping that if I finessed it, it would curve around Mignolet. Alright, half time. I think we're in control of the game. But they're still playing very well. The stat says this is a very even game, but I think I think everyone knows that we're kind of we're kind of leading it. Is that Tahith or is that Chong? Like the yep, that's Chong, the Manchester United youngin. So we gotta watch out for him because he is fast, decent in size, and he's good with both feet. But apparently, he can't pass. So, whoa. I mean, I think that challenge should be a yellow. I mean, you hurt him. Go, Summers. Pace. 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 Back post. Or Hotich. Or Hotich. That works too. That works too. Oh, let's go. Um. I don't want to take Hogus off just quite yet. I want the, okay, ball's back in play. I mean, I don't want to take him off, but I think we probably should for defensive reinforcements. And I cannot take can't do what he can do offensively, but at this point in the game, we're playing defense, so I think that's the move. But after that, it's been disappointing. I'd like to see them use those wide areas around the defense. Get around. Why would you touch that, you idiot? There needs to be like a leave it button. Or if your players just have a little bit of common sense. Kidding. Well, as we see again here, it's a beauty of a ball over the top, and still with lots to do. He'll Why did Van der suck in so much? Gave the keeper little chance. Lovely goal that was. Well, another equalizer. What a topsy turvy game this has been. And we're inside that Hogus substitution looks minutes. stupid. Chong. Moving 
into the advanced position. Well, okay, I was gonna, if they scored that, I was going to freak out. Ago. Ago, you're literally garbage. Literally. I hate you with a burning passion. Your inability to score as a striker is very concerning to me. And Hazard's inability to play his position so he can get a ball back and quickly counterattack is also threatening to me. We did not convert this. I will hat um subbing him off. Subbing him off. Yep, he's definitely getting taken off. I don't even know who our backup, but I do know it can't be worse than him. Yeah, he's 69 shooting. Both of 69 shooting. Mate. Hazard, could you at least try to win the header? You get Van Dyke back out there. goes off. And firing it into the area. Former. I think our offseason or our big money splash in January might be uh might be striker. High kick, please. Looks promising this. Just cutting off the supply. Well, sloppy in possession. Why? What is up with the absolute disconnect between our midfield and our forwards? They're literally not even in the, anywhere near the same zip code. And that's a slight issue. Okay, penalty. You say, what, 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 what's going on? Why did we stop it? He's about to shoot and score. And if that was anyone... If that was Hulgas, I would not have wanted that penalty to be called. Alright, come on. Otich, for your hat trick. Let's go! Hat trick. Oh, no, it's not his hat trick. Doesn't matter. Player of the game to win the Battle of the Bruges. Otich steps up from the penalty spot. And converts it. Now I swear, if you idiots somehow find a way to concede a goal in the next minute, in the final minute of the game, it's like 
I mean, it's 20 seconds in real life. Can I just go for tactical fouling? We just, we just foul everybody? Don't need to. Don't need to. How is that L taste, losers? Dino. Hotich. Hattrick. Hero. Let's go. Hotich. Best player on the planet. I'll give him that. He's going to go down. He's one of the... One of the Circle Brews. He's going to be the Circle voilà, Brews legend. Hogus is off for three months. That's not good. Because Hotich is leading the revolution. We are sick voilà, and tired bon, of being that team. That Circle Brews just gets pummeled by. Wait, wait, so Hogas is suspended for the next game when he comes back for being out for three months. So he's out for three months and a game. Okay, then. That is quite the uh, interesting uh, bit of circumstances, if I do say so myself. Didn't exactly... Uh, All right, got a good deal of money there for Vitinho. So yeah, that should give us about five million euros or whatever. Nah, yep, we can lose him. Uh, I'm sorry, Bayern, Bayern Cone, you're not playing. We have the next hottest right back prospects in all of Belgian football. Yeah, I know you're not usually one to complain. I'm not I'm not joining Venezuela. All right, it's almost Christmas time. So hopefully we can get a nice Christmas present in a win in our upcoming game. Which will hopefully mean if things work out right, we can go ahead of Club Bruges. Yep. Oh, trust me, Kanate, you're you're playing. You're, you have to you have to be playing now. No, um, let's see here. Who wants to be here? Dykper. Uh, yeah, we'll send this game. Hopefully, we can win. Yep, two-one win. Holtich with another goal. Holtich is the top scorer in the league. Well. This has been a very good episode for this team. Oh, 
Bitcoin Corin has now officially converted to that defensive mid position, so that was definitely that will also definitely be something to keep an eye on in the future. But yeah, that's going to conclude this episode of Circle Brewers Career Mode series. I hope that you all have enjoyed, and it is J Beebs signing off.